put one inside. Put my finger down there all the way. Good. He swallowed. Hey guys, welcome to the end of the year YouTube video for Ron Johnson, a mental health coach, fish enthusiast, and soon to be therapist. And the fish room has grown. I mean, you got Arowana there, you got Cooper there, you got the shovel nose there, and my favorite monster, Arapaima. So what I'm gonna do is show an end of year clips and take a look how it started and how it's going. Stay tuned. Hope you guys enjoyed those videos. It's had, definitely has grown. I started with one tank, which is the 180. Then went to the, the 75, which you saw here, which is probably my old steam rank tank. Then I got a 75 there. I got a 150 here. I got a palm back behind there, which you guys saw in my videos. And boy, what a year it's been. Uh, from rescuing fish, to adding fish to the fish room, to fish death, to the disease, to to not understanding everything about an individual animal, an individual animal as in though, you know, what it needs, what it wants, what it to change, anything better. Everything has grown and that's how life really works is that in order to become better, you have to grow and you have to get out of your comfort zone. You have to understand something, you have to try something. That's what's more important, trying something for the first time. And the fish room has been that and I'm going to continue to grow and I'm going to continue to look at all these beautiful fish and just take a look at the fish I have. I look forward to rescuing more fish. I look forward to showing you guys, hey, I'm just a fish enthusiast and a mental health coach in this paradigm that's going to help you guys live a better life. And one tip here for the last end of this year, think to yourself one thing to consider. If you had to get one word to describe 2022, what would it be? If you have to give one word to describe 2023, what would it be? My one word for 2022 is reconstruction. I've been going through a lot of reconstruction in my personal life, in my professional life, in my hobby life, just trying to re-engage. And those that know me out there is just three or four years ago, I was a personal trainer. Now I'm a full-time mental health coach. And I'm going back to school to become a therapist and how things can just change just like that. So reconstruction has been the biggest thing for 2022. Now for 2023, it's where it starts with a G and it's growth. After all these experiences and what I experienced the last couple of years, now it's time to grow, taking all these experiences and put it together to be a better person. So the reason why I say growth and name it now, because automatically that's where I wanna be at the end of 2023 is growth. Grow professionally, grow mentally, grow the fish room, grow as a person, read books, all these things because the first thought is if you want to be anywhere or go anywhere is growth and to begin with the end in mind. So if I want to end with growth in 2023, I have to start now, put all the pieces together so I can grow. One thing I heard from one of my favorite motivational speakers, Jim Rohn said, you have to be the law of the farmer, which means that what does the farmer have to do in order to reap the harvest? He has to Till the soil, he has to plant the seed, he has to water the seeds or water the soil, and, and then he has to wait for the right time to harvest. So during reconstruction of 2022, I've been, been planting, I've been watering, so that 2023, I can reap the harvest and go on to my next destination of my life and keep enjoying this and keep learning and keep growing. So I want to say thanks guys for out there for all your support, for subscribing to my channel, asking me questions, and 
just being part of this whole team of, of what I'm doing here. Not just talking about fish, but also talking about mental health as well too, and how important it really is. And subscribe, like, hit the bell, comment, and stay tuned for more fishies, more mental health, and I'll see you in 2023. Thanks for listening.